Okay, this is the virtual tour of both my pot plants. We had to do a voiceover for this first section because the wind was so bad. Uh, we're outside the Rose and Crown pub in Wivenhoe and we're walking down to the boat for my pot plants, which is on the quay uh, on the mooring outside the pub. And I'm just saying to Oliver, my son, who recorded this film, be careful not to fall over the plank like I nearly did. And we're just about to walk over on the over the pulpit uh, of the boat and I'm just saying uh, this is the Houdini hatch which needs a bit of repair and I'm pointing out the garden which is uh, adorned with astroturf and uh, specially made um, planters with pansies in uh, that need a little bit of attention and the solar panel which is on the top of the boat uh, which provides electricity for the inside of the boat and they're the little multicoloured lights that also work off solar energy so we're walking down the side of the boat now and uh, you can see the multicoloured canopy uh, and the two little dogs that are out uh, looking out the window Tintin dogs um, the canopy uh, is made out of different types of coloured material uh, especially for the boat for my pot plants and we're just about to climb in now we're going to come up to the end of the voiceover because we can hand back to the recording that I did on the inside of the boat right okay now this is the back bit this is the um, the rear deck and uh, I've opened this up so you can see the magnificent view that we have And what I'll do is I'll, I'll close this down. Now this multicolour canopy has been made specially for the boat by a wonderful company who, um, who are quite happy, and I was quite happy for them to use multicoloured bits of material. We'll close this up a little bit as well because it's a bit noisy. I think, okay, right, so there we go. So. There we are. So here we have um, we have the speakers, loudspeakers for the hi-fi, where we can, so we can have parties on the back here. And if you come inside here into the cabin, um, we've got a nice soft shag pile carpet. Underneath, we've got specially made tiles that are made so that I can lower the floor so that somebody like me. Can stand up if you, if you take the tiles up which they just lift up you see occasionally you get a bit of collection of water rainwater that gets in somehow um, you just mop it up with a sponge every now and again so put the tile back that's it put the carpet back there that makes it nice and warm and cozy we've got some lovely cushions here that came with the boat and Jane um, covered them with uh, some old curtains that were given to us um, the windows have been well, the wind, this window was broken, actually, I think I remember from the last time. There was a crack in the window. We've got a new window, and we've got new rubbers put, put on by a local um, company that uh, helped me out with that. <coughs> uh, we have in here, because we've got a solar panel on the roof, on the, uh, on the garden bit, we've got um, uh, a little thing here for the electricity, and we have the hi-fi on we can have hi-fi with uh, these round speakers here and the speakers that are out on the back there. Dab radio. We've got lights. Lights. And lights on here as well. Uh, where are they? Oh, where's the light? Oh, there it is. <laughs> There's the lights. There we are. We've got four lights. Uh, very comfortable to lay on the bed here. Don't bang your head. Shit. What was that? Oh yeah, there's something I forgot to show you. Um, that noise was the water tank. There's a water tank under here, and I've had that repaired. But when you want to sleep here, it's actually very comfortable. Ah, <laughs> oh, like that. Ah, and the water tank that I've sorted out, you fill the water outside, it runs down the underneath here, into the tank, and then I've repaired the pump in the galley this is the kitchen well uh, galley i think it's called and uh, 
here, if we take that off, we've got a little tap here and a pump and then water comes out and I've repaired that all myself. I'm quite impressed with, well, I'm not really impressed, but I was surprised that I could do it. So, uh, show us your kitchen area. Right, this is the kitchen area, this is the galley. Uh, here is my cooking facilities. I better turn these lights off, by the way, otherwise I'll use up all the battery for no reason at all. That's it, and I'll turn the hi-fi off as well, and turn that off, that's it. Uh, yeah, in here, the kitchen, we've got the, um, the cooking facility. If I turn that on, it comes on and I can put on, a, a, I've got a saucepan here, I think somewhere. Yeah, look, I've got a matching blue frying pan. I can have uh, bacon, I can have anything I want, really. I've got a saucepan I can make something with. I've got butter. Ooh, better turn that off, otherwise it'll catch fire to something but luckily we have got um, a, uh, a thing we jig uh, <laughs> uh, a fire extinguisher that's the word a theme jig yeah we've got uh, baked beans soup Uncle Ben's rice uh, we've got in here we've got beer crisps we've got we've got the lot really we've got the lot um, this is the water for the uh, plants that are on top Oh, by the way, this is called a fiddle. I've made this, this is a fiddle. And um, actually the fiddle is technically, I think, the thing that stops the bits falling off. But I think it's now become known, the fiddle is the whole sort of shelf thing. Um, <clears throat> right, if you come out here, then I'll show you the toilet. So here, there was a door here which opened up fully like that and it's very awkward because you couldn't walk past but I've, I've cut it in half and made it bifolding so that now you can see the nice clean toilet area that we've got with a, a toilet that I found on the skip, brand new uh, a nice little shelf there, toilet roll holder and here is my little library of books uh, and up there is the hoover which is uh, always on charge so we can keep the boat nice and clean and tidy. <clears throat> um, a bottle of gin, which I don't drink actually, that's just in case somebody comes on and wants one. Uh, what else do you have to do on the boat? Well there's a few bits of work to be done still. The main thing is to get a motor, uh, which is the, the next sort of major job to be done. Uh, I've got to connect up all these cables and things, I'm, I'm, I'm not even sure what they are yet. Um, but that's got to be repaired. This is all going to be sanded down and uh, varnished and there's a few little odd leaks here and there that I've got to work out where they're coming from and, and, and repair them. But the, the majority of the work is now, come, not it hasn't ended yet but it's coming to an end. But there's still quite a bit to do. As I say, the main thing being the motor, that's like a major, major job. Uh, but anyway, um, it's providing a lot of fun and I hope, I hope that you, the viewer, has enjoyed this virtual tour of the both my pot plants and thank you for watching.